Okay. Here's the plan. Do I have a say in this? Yes. Feel free to intervene whenever necessary. However, our main objective is to grab that key. Because, if my guess is correct... Guys! You... He's locked every damn door in this place. Are you certain you saw the key on his belt? Yes, I saw it as clear as day. There was one loop ring with three silver keys on it. So, how are we going to get it? This is what I had in mind. When things are clear and we have him cornered, assuming we find him first. Tate, you'll stay hidden and distract him by throwing an item across the room. I'm assuming he's been in the attic all this time. We haven't touched that room yet. If we're lucky, he won't spot either of us. When he hears the noise, I sneak into the room and grab the key. Then I'll toss it to you, and you run for the front door. I can't let you do that! What if you get caught? If he kills you, I won't be able to forgive myself. You don't have to worry about me. We're both very capable people. We can do this. Are you okay with this plan? I suppose so. If you say it will work, then I trust you. We need to survive this. For our friends. For everyone we would otherwise leave behind. You can do this. It's for them. Ready? you hey looking for this clean what are you doing something I've needed to do for a long time this wasn't part of the plan Tate I have to he's the one who killed my mother I didn't 
What? You shouldn't mention that sooner! Still keeping secrets, huh? That was always a quality I liked about you. You're as loyal to me as I am to you. That's not true. I keep my secrets to protect myself from people like you. And to protect my friends! What the... <laughs> Does your little girlfriend know who your other parent is? No, and she never will. She's not my girlfriend either. At least acknowledge that I'm your father, Clayne. You can't hide from me forever. You're his son? <laughs> you think you're clever. You think you can suppress the fact that you're the son of a serial killer and live a normal life? Too bad. That's not the way it works while I'm still around. And now, it's your fault that your friends have ended up... You think Clan knew about your plans to murder us? He didn't. Do this. You're the monster! Let me handle this. Clayne, you can't allow him to talk you down like that. You didn't know any of this would happen, right? Of course not. I heard about a jailbreak, but I didn't think it would be him that got out. I didn't think he'd be so persistent. I just need to talk to him one last time to finish what I started. To think... After all that I've done for you, you keep defying me. I had plans for you, Clayton, and by confronting me like this, nonetheless stealing my property, you're ruining everything. I ruined everything? Did I kill my own wife and other innocent people and kidnap my son for the sake of it? You're not the victim here! You made my life a living hell! I warned Sianna to stay out of the way, but she had to intervene. I gave her the option to let me take you away, but she didn't stop. I had to do it when she was finally gone and you were older. You somehow escaped and called the cops on your dear old dad. Are you listening to yourself? That's not normal! She was protecting me! Wait, Clan, you were kidnapped? I thought this entire time you just moved away during middle school. Everyone told me that was what happened! <laughs> Why didn't you tell me about any of this? I... I couldn't. I couldn't risk losing you. He knows that I'll always be around. Why did you do all of this? Why did you kill our friends tonight? They were innocent and had nothing to do with this! Why did you kill his mom? Why are you the way you are? His selfish mother and some nosy teenagers think they knew everything about commitment and loyalty, but they didn't. Do you think you're an expert? I may only be 17, but I know more about those traits than you ever will. I full heartedly trust Clean's choices, and I haven't even killed anyone to keep his friendship. You thought that taking him away from everyone he ever loved would help your relationship? Yes, it would make him mine. That is messed up! You are a sick man. He was only a kid! You deserve to be! Enough of this. You've wasted too much of my time. He's my son. They got too close and they had to die. And now, so will you. Tate! Run! <gasps> Get back here! You can't run! I'll find you!
Tate. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that I never said anything. Every ounce of me told me not to. Because if I did, you would leave me just like everyone else. I would never think of doing that. I would never run away. You're my best and closest friend. I know you wouldn't hurt anyone. As long as he's alive, he will continue to hurt people who don't deserve it. He will kill you tonight. And I can't have that. What are you saying? You know, if it weren't for you, I don't know if I'd still be here. You've supported me through all these years. We finally have the keys. But the only way to truly stop my father is... No, 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 you said it yourself that you would escape with me! I intentionally didn't make that promise. You will get out, but I won't. You are not staying here, don't do this! You'll never stop if I don't do something drastic. I'm burning down this house, not only to rid this world of my father, but to rid the town of the memories of their serial killer. When I'm gone, if he somehow survives, there will be nothing left for him to kill for. He'll be safe, and I'll finally be free. Show yourself, you maggots! Come out, come out, wherever you are. <laughs> Clean all- Thank you for everything. There has to be another way. There you are! Watch out! Get out of my way! No! If you touch her, this whole place goes up in flames! Watch me. <laughs> Let go of her. Now. What have you done? If you can't have me, no one can. I'll reunite with my mother up there. But you're going straight to hell. Right where you belong. Leave! Go! No, you can't do this. This is what I've worked so hard for. I'm your father, goddammit! You forgot one thing while creating your plans tonight. I'm the one in control now. I have to expose this. Clean, Adam, Fern, Dream, Phoebe. The other people who is hurt. They all need to be avenged.
god thank you guys so much for all the support on the series i just re i just wanted to thank you guys so much for watching this finale episode of the house in the woods if you guys are wondering yes this series is actually not over but i'm not gonna spoil it just yet but first off i just want to thank you to i just want to send a thanks to everyone who has helped out with this series um any body actors voice actors all of you guys are freaking amazing thank you so much without you all um i wouldn't be able to make the series that me and rachel kai wrote by the way uh rachel kai aka some of you may know her as super ray um helped me with co-writing for the series and um i just want to say a big thank you to you as well rachel because i i don't know where i would be after uh if i didn't complete this <laughs> but anyways yeah thank you guys so much um i before the video ends i just wanted to say that we might be doing a meet the crew and cast kind of podcast panel soon um i'm not sure when exactly that'll happen yet but if you guys are interested in meeting the cast learning more about the characters for the house in the woods and just vibing with us uh, feel free to keep tabs with us because I might be trying to get together with everyone and talking with them soon. But anyways guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, be sure to check the link, the description down below. Uh, there will be credits and stuff uh, in the description. But yeah, anyways guys, thank you so much and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye Love you all!